what is going on everyone welcome back to the channel today i'm pretty excited to share with you a new series that i have wanted to do for like the last month now um uh, you may have heard me speak about this before and i've actually like had this kind of prepared for the last kind of month but um, i've just wanted to make sure i got everything right and ready like for a couple of episodes so that i can upload one a week and be able to upload like consistently um, not upload the first episode rush it and then have to wait a month for the other one so um basically this is going to be a, a 10 pound to 1000 pound challenge like well not a challenge it's like a series um which is going to be involving thrifting car booting although car boots are kind of stopped at the minute but we'll see how it goes um like buying items from other places and selling them on different places um i don't know how i feel about uh, like reselling supreme and stuff if i'm gonna bother putting that in because uh people might get a bit funny about that but we'll see um but yeah anyway this is basically going to be a 10 pounds to a thousand pounds so i started off i've bought two items um which i will show you uh soon um and then i'm basically at the end of the video so the way that the structure of the video is going to work is at the beginning i'll show you what i picked up and at the end i'm going to show you what's sold um from the from that video and then uh, yeah so that's how it's going to work so at the beginning I'll show you what i picked up and then at the end show you what sold um from the obviously the things that i've got for sale and um yeah and at the end of the next episode i will show you what i used that money to pick up so um i will show you i, the, I basically recorded a video of me showing you the items uh, like a month ago when I was going to do this but I didn't like the intro and the ex explanation of it and also I kind of I originally was going to make a new Depop account um, and stuff like that and go completely from scratch but I decided I wasn't going to do that anymore I thought I'd just use my Depop account because it was just too annoying going back and forth back and forth and I wanted to just make sure everything was all good um, so yeah I started on my Depop account and um, that's how I'm gonna go through for the rest of the series. So um, yeah, I'm pretty excited to show you this guys because uh, I haven't seen this done before. Uh, closest thing to this was the Paul Cantu a thousand pound or a thousand dollars in a day challenge. Uh, but I think that was a little bit too unrealistic um, just because I assume most of you guys, some of you might, some like I'm just, the majority of you guys won't have hundreds of thousands of subscribers to sell to or uh, your own vintage website or your own whatever, your own uh, audience to sell to. Um, along like me, I just use Depop. I don't sell to you guys. I don't sell to like people that I know. I just sell to depop and that's something that any of you can use uh, or ebay or blah 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 you know what i'm talking about anyway um i will put the little clip of my video of me showing you the items now it's going to be a completely different setup and completely different uh um like well just everything but that's because as i said i recorded this a month ago uh but yeah stay tuned for that and uh yeah i'll catch you after that so anyway this is um the kind of best item that i picked up so i spent eight pounds on this it was originally 12 pounds um i picked it up from uh coats i believe um which is funny because this is actually a coat but yeah coats the charity shop um and is a heli hansen it is actually a vintage one because i noticed on the sleeve um uh, on the sleeve it says compact computers um and you know i don't i'm pretty sure compact aren't about anymore so this is a vintage piece which is really cool i thought it was just kind of a new age thing um but yeah we've got this coat here you'll see better in the uh, in the video that i put but yeah we've got the nice it's like maybe an off-white colorway with the uh heli hansen in the middle and then on the back on the packable hood there is a, a big Heli Hansen embroidered and this is such a clean piece like no like there's pretty much I don't think there's any marks at all uh, which is really nice for like a bit that has cream on it and it's such a nice coat size extra large I'm very happy to pick that up um, this next item uh, I picked up you're gonna have to take my word for it because I lost the receipt because I'm an idiot and um, I actually didn't get any I wasn't planning on using this for this series but I thought I, when I got home and I bought that for eight pound, I was like, "Oh, this was two pound. I'll just use this." Um, so yeah, I'm going to be using this. This is my second item. Very, it's a smaller item, of, obviously, because it's only two pound. But 
This is a vintage Adidas cap, which I thought was really cool. Um, we got this nice like patch on the front. There you go, you can see the patch. Really, really nice. Um, paid two pound for this, as I've said. Um, it's not actually like a snapback or anything. It's like, um, well, this says A Flex, which to me seems like it's um, a hat that's got like one size, like one size fits all type thing. Well, I mean, that's what a usual hat is like, but it's a different type of technology in here that's kind of makes it stretchier. Um, so that would be my second item. I'm hoping to get about 30 to 40 pound for the Heli Hansen, which would be great to kick us off with this. And then maybe about 10 pound for this, which would also be very, very good. And we can go into the next video with like um, 30, 40, or maybe even 50 pounds for the both of them. And that would be great to get us kick started in the series. Anyway guys, so now I've showed you kind of what I picked up. So I obviously got that Heli Hansen coat, which is really, really nice. And uh, also the Adidas cap, um, which I, I'm gonna be honest with you, I listed the Heli Hansen cap, um, Heli Hansen coat and the cap up on the, when I was gonna make a new Depop. I listed them up straight away, uh, but I listed the Heli Hansen on my personal, and that's like, obviously, as I said, I'm gonna be using that from now. But I forgot to list the Adidas cap, so I need to do that. So hopefully soon, uh, well, after this episode, I will uh, list it up and hopefully that will sell soon. But I have good news, the, um, Heli Hansen coat sold. Um, it took like a week or two weeks or something like that, I'm not sure. But as I said, I wanted to try and get 30 to 40 pound for it. And I managed to get uh, 35 pound plus three pound 50 shipping on Depop. So if we calculate that, you take the 10% off Depop and then you take the Depop fee, 10% uh, off Depop, which leaves, uh, what does that leave? So. £3.85 that takes off and then I'll put the like the maths on the screen and then the Depop fee uh, so I was originally I was left with probably like £30 or £32 or something like that but as I said it will be on the screen now which is really really nice considering we started with £10 just sold the first item and uh, I am going to be I'm got, I was tempted to show you what I picked up with that money now, but I will leave that to the beginning of the next episode. Um, hopefully that video will be out soon. I mean, if you guys enjoy the video, make sure to drop a like. Um, and then if you know if it gets good reception, I'll drop the next episode quick. Uh, if not, then I'll just leave it till, uh, I haven't got a set date for this, by the way. I'm not gonna be setting it like every Monday or every blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna, just gonna be, um, just gonna be uploading it once a week, um, unless, you know, if the reception is really good, uh, then I'll upload it a couple of times a week, but we'll see how it goes. Hopefully, as we get more items to sell, uh, I can do more, but obviously, when you've only got one or two items for sale, it's quite difficult, like, you have to obviously wait for one or two items to sell, whereas if you've got more, then obviously you've got a higher chance of that selling. So, anyway, at the end of each episode, I'm gonna put like a total of how much money we got in the bank, um, and then, um, yeah, that's how it's gonna go. And then, obviously, as I said, at the next the beginning of the next episode, I'll show you what I picked up with that money. Um, I'm not gonna try and spend all the money all the time. Like, if there's not something, I'm not gonna waste it. Um, I wanted to spend the 10 pound originally just because it's a nice round number. I thought spending 10 pound would be good. Uh, but if, like, as now we got like 30 odd pound, I'm not just gonna go and splash that on loads of things. Um, if obviously if I find nice things and I will but if not then there's no point so anyway guys I hope you did enjoy the first episode I know it's been a little bit boring but I just kind of wanted to introduce you to what I'm doing um, and yeah hopefully you enjoyed and stay tuned for the next episode that will be out very soon but stay tuned on my Instagram because I will obviously let you know when the next video is going to be out anyway guys hope you have a good day I'll see you later peace bye